Hey, it's Adon here, adoncoin.com, where I teach you how to play in Dead Gad Guitar. In this lesson, you don't have to worry about the tuning, though, because we're just going to be focusing in on that right-hand technique, playing the Irish jig rhythm, and in particular, this double-down strum, which you're going to see a lot of guitar players in Irish music playing, and it's a tricky one to get at the start, but once you get it, it's there for life. So we're going to go through it beat by beat, then we're going to have a slow metronome, medium metronome, fast metronome count, and then we're going on to the tune, and we'll be able to strum along to a tune. We're also going to emphasize different beats within the strum just so we can keep things interesting for ourselves. So one thing to note when we're going through Irish music, you want to be able to strum from your elbow. So just to get a nice powerful strum at the start. So that's something to focus in on. And then later on, just focus in on the wrist as well. So you have those both options to go with. So for the nice subtle stuff and that, that nice powerful strum as well. So just wanted to say that at the start. So let's go through this beat by beat. It's in 6-8 time. So we have this down up down down up down one two three four five six you want a nice relaxed hand doing this as well so when we speed things up so one two three four five six down up down down up down down up down down up down it's just going to take a little bit of time maybe to get that double down going but it's just a case of practice. You're gonna drive everyone in your house mad just playing that down, up, down, just practicing that until it's, it's natural. So we're gonna start off slow. We're gonna have 80 beats per minute. So we'll work on the metronome here and then we'll work through, through things. So four, five, six, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, one, two, three, four, five, six, down, up, down, down, up, down. Cool. So we'll move it up now to 120 ish. So as I said, get your or you should get your metronome out if you can't keep up, and then just work up to this, and you'll be able to play it in no time. So four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, down, up. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. Now we'll move it up to 200 beats per minute. Five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Down, up, down, down. Excellent. So now I was saying that we'd put emphasis on certain beats. And this is just to kind of make the tune move along as you're playing with someone. So let's go for emphasis on the first beat to start. We won't get too complicated here. So we're going to have emphasis on the one. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, 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 one. And it's it's just um you don't have to emphasize it too much. It's subtle, so it's just a bit of a push. It's like one, two, three, four. Cool. Ne another one that you can do is an emphasis on the four. So this is going to be just another way of pushing that tune along. So one, two, three, four, five, six, one. So that's a way to put it on the four. Now we can combine those, those that one and the four. So that's gonna be emphasis on the first and the fourth. In future videos, we'll go through more complicated stuff, but this is just gonna give that nice groove and it's one that you'll hear all the time. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six. So practice that slow with your metronome, getting that those emphasis on different beats and just having a bit of fun with it. So now we'll move on to a tune, but we don't have to worry about the emphasis in this, just get the that strum down. Um, so I have my dad here, Mick Coyne, on the whistle, and he's an Illin Piper extraordinaire as well. So he's gonna play a tune for us, and we're gonna strum along. Don't need any chords, just strumming. So this just to get it in our heads with a tune. So hold it now. 
One, two, three, four. Nice one, excellent. Well, if you didn't, if you couldn't keep up there, just um, I'd say start with the metronome, work up the speed, um, take your time with it, then listen to plenty of jigs and start just strumming along with them. I'm sure you can find loads of, of jigs in slow time, slow tempo, and then working it up to medium tempo, fast tempo, just getting that strum locked in. And uh, you'll have a lot of fun with it. It's, it's just a great one to have in the trick bag so if you enjoyed that video give it a thumbs up a like if you have any questions at all just leave them in the comments i'm happy to help out and i will see you on the next video i have plenty more to come so i'll see you then all the best